That's right, I think it's FTL time again. So, you're not seeing me today, mostly because, one, I didn't want to have to undo my camera setup for my role-playing computer, and two, I'm not looking or feeling all that great right now, so I'm just going to play a round of FTL. It's not going to be that complicated, but, oh, well, oh well. What do I want to play as? I've already done Gila Monster B. How about Mana War B? That wouldn't be too bad. Sure. And today I'm playing on normal mode. I didn't mention this last time, but the previous FTL run that I did, I was playing on easy. This time I'm playing on normal. I usually played on normal back when I was still dealing with um, pre-advanced edition content, but I had to bounce myself back to normal, back to easy, after dealing with that. Hmm. Oh, I hate dealing with only missiles. Oh, nice starting place. Oh, right. I can teleport. Looks like Rock and an Engie. I think I can deal with that. There. This is an FTL trick if anybody didn't know about it. You can actually rearrange the order of people inside of a room by pausing, having one person click out of the room, next person click out of the room, and then have the person that you want to be in the first spot in the room click back into the room, and the second one back into the room. All it will do is swap spots. It's not too bad. It's good for maximizing, um, or spreading out damage across multiple characters. Useful for teleportation-based strategies like mine. I don't have a hospital. That's... Why did I do that? <laughs> oh well. Not much I can do at this point. I need to buy one badly. Oh well. Great. This is not at all what I want, but that's okay. Actually, you're gonna target oxygen. Cause that laser can't actually hurt me. Then you're going to target weapon helm. Oh, you actually powered your weaponry system. Let me deal with that for you. Do, 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 do. Most likely the ship will end up dying because I don't think I can keep the oxygen down low enough. And they keep dodging. Grrr. Helm. Yeah, you're not going anywhere like that. I am not powering my oxygen. That's foolish of me. This is potentially going to suck. Oh, that's right, I have healing bombs. That's how I can heal myself. Oh well. Bye bye. You don't get to jump. Okay, let's get everybody into the same room. And then healing bomb. And 
Everybody go back. I forget about actually using healing bombs. I don't normally use them. And let's jump to even more nebula. Go down there first. <laughs> sure. That was a mistake. Yeah, just in case. So, um, when it comes to auto scouts, the best way to handle them, which is not the way I did last time, but the best way to handle them is you basically just have lasers galore. I don't have any lasers on this ship, so I'm doing this very unoptimally. Beam weapons are pretty good at it too. If you do just enough to be able to drop their shields and then beam weapon them to death, it's great. Ooh, sweet. You are going up front. So, Heavy Laser does extra damage at certain points, if I remember right. Uh, doo -doo 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 -doo. Heavy Laser... Yeah, it does two damage rather than one. Which, not that useful, to be honest. Uh, usually, I prefer lasers to just... do damage to shields and nothing else. Yeah, and this is what slug ships get automatically. It's not really all that useful. But I get to jump around a whole bunch in Sector 1, which is nice. Intruders. How about the two of you run over there? to their original positions. Really, can, this is probably it could be a great ship to get a cloning bay on, to be honest. Yeah, I think I'll bounce there. I forgot to switch this to Artemis. Who? Sheldon or Kara? These are pretty okay-ish prices. Um, this is actually cheaper than normal. This is more expensive than normal, I believe. I think it's 35 and 45. But I already have a teleportation-based strategy, so I will go ahead and grab Kara. Welcome aboard, Kara. You now handle engines. Because to be honest, my engine person's not that great anyway. And it's close to the teleporter room, which is useful. Still no shop. It's weird. I've definitely seen that. I haven't seen that one yet. So I think I'll do there, 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 there. Yeah. Of course you are. You probably feel like that. And. Actually,
Be safe now. Do -do 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 -do. Oh, I forgot to move him in. I didn't realize he was injured too. Oh well. Still no store. This is weird. Usually there's like two or three stores on the first sector. They must be all right next to each other. Okay, that's an uh, anti-drone bot. I think I can send two people in without too much of an issue. is a standard defense bot. This is going to potentially suck. was really close. So they could have potentially jumped without me being able to do a thing about it and I would have lost two of my crew. That would have just been a reset right there and then. So I bet one of these was probably a store. Oh well. I only have 47? Crap, I'm really low on this. Close to a sun no. Nothing fair. Let's go to a store because might as well. Oh, I was hoping for cloning lab. Sensors are worthless. I have a slug ship. It's not that big of a deal. Um, med bay is kind of needed, but I wanted cloning. No. Oh. But I'd have to also have to sell something. Probably the repair gel. Let's be honest, it's not that useful. Well, I guess it sort of is, now that I think about it. Let's go ahead and sell the heal bomb. Pick up a med bay. And then have everybody report to the med bay. Or everybody entered, at least. So, not Maxim. Yeah, I have tons of time. I might even be able to do three hops. Either way, I'll go down to the lower one first. Oh, another auto scout. Um, actually, no shields? I can take that pretty easily. Do -do -do -do. I will probably end up fast forwarding most of this video when I actually upload it.
Yeah, at least I get some scrap. Yeah. Jump as many places as possible in the first sector. I got all but two, which is pretty good. Oh, crap. This is going to suck. So this is a Zoltan shield. Zoltan shields are annoying to get through when all you have is a standard laser. I mean, missiles are actually pretty terrible against Zoltan shields, so I'm not going to bother wasting any. I don't even know what that is. Other than a beam weapon of some variety, obviously. Yeah, let's go ahead and waste one as well. I don't want to mess around with that. You're not going to repair your weapon, I'm sorry. I might as well keep firing. I mean, it levels up my guy. My green slug. I did not want to trust them in there any longer. <sighs> then they don't actually have a med bay, so it's not that big of a deal. Especially when I can do things like that. Okay. Redirect back to life support. These two are probably good enough, but I want them to be fully healed just in case. There we go. Pirate instigator, I just saw that. No, not jump. Teleport. Directly in. There we go. I will totally take a mantis. So let's go back to stations. Mantis, your new station is... Well, I guess you can go into the doors. Not like it's gonna hurt. And you're still gonna make it pretty fast to where you need to go. I forgot to heal Kara. Oh well. Always explore the asteroid field. Uh, Kara, why don't you heal? Next sector. Mm, I'm not very well equipped, so I think I'd rather go civilian. This run is not going all that well right now, to be quite honest. Yeah, let's go hit the store. Maybe they'll have a weapon that doesn't suck. Or, you know, hacking and mind control. So many nice things. And the Zoltan. Ooh, so many nice things. Well, I can't afford hacking, which is sad. I can afford mind control, though. It's totally worth it with slugs. So, the idea behind mind control is that you use this and you can temporarily control an opponent as long as you can see that opponent. The AI cheats and will mind control things that they can't see, or, yeah, they can't see, but at the same time, a slug can see all the things, so using a slug to mind control is quite nice, or having slugs for mind control. So, for instance, I can just go ahead and do... Mind control that guy. See? Then I have these two go in. Teleport 
in deal with weapons. That's not good. So, I need to repair this ASAP. Actually, you're gonna go there, you're going to go there. Damn it! Freaking hell. That was my own dumbass fault. Return to stations. <sighs> yeah, I screwed that up. Badly. Plus, I got a human! Yay! Stupid human. Something's on fire. I don't know what. That's on fire. I might as well just space that part of the ship for a while. It's easier. Do 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 do. Okay. That would help if I did that. Open up all the other doors. Oh, right. That would help. There we go. So, you are there. You are going back there. You are just going to stay in there because you were slow. Let's get my oxygen back for a bit. That's good enough. Distress seek beacon. I must go. Probably a trap. Oh, fire. Emergency respirators. Nice. It's not something you can normally get. Mm, running a little low on fuel. Always explore. Damn. I have no idea where the fire is. So I am just going to expose all of that. Okay, it's not in there, so fire will be out soon enough. Fire's out. Like I said, I usually get it up to about 70, and then that's probably good enough. Something to fight? Yay! Unfortunately, it's something not useful to fight. At all. I am the exact wrong type of ship to be able to handle this. Yeah, they can't get through my shield, so I'm not too concerned about that. Take out their shields. Got fuel. That's helpful. Store up there, eh? Nah, I'd rather bounce for a bit. Mind control. A 
laser charger for 45. Totally worth it. So, a laser charger allows you to charge up to four shots of a laser at once, which is very nice for things like auto assaults. There, like that. I should have bounced to the lower one. Oh well. Another auto scout. Great. Fortunately, this time their weapons can hurt me, and can hurt me pretty bad. That's not the weapon I wanted to take out. Seriously? <sighs> Hello, Zunkini. My cats are probably starting to get a little hungry. It's getting closer to their eating time. Still have about an hour, but... Or 45 minutes. It's also about the time I have until somebody arrives for board game night. So, every Friday night... Friday. Today's not Friday. Every Sunday night, I have a board gaming night. Board gaming is awesome. I highly recommend doing it if you have a group of friends that like geeky-like things. Seriously, how many auto scouts am I going to find here? And one with a cloaking device. Great! I don't need that, and I have a cat in between me and being able to see, so I apologize for me being a little slower. Yeah, you might even hear him, given he keeps hitting the... whatchamacallit. Don't... please stop spinning around. Zone's now sitting on top of my hand that is using the mouse. So I'm actually playing this for my living room. Oh, that's mean. Big ol' meanie heads. So, like I said, I'm actually playing this for my living room, or family room couch right now. I'm playing this on the TV rather than from my desk. Uh, damn it, cat. Zone, seriously. Calm yourself. I have something in my lap. That means that you cannot be on my lap at the same time and sit. Ah, uh, he's orbiting me again. Kinda wish I had the camera set up so you can see him perch on my shoulder while I play games, but this area is also really messy. I've got lots of scrap. Uh, yeah, it's probably worth spending the... One, two, three, one, two, three... Yeah, let's go there first. Well, that was worthless. Store. Uh, I should have bounced to the lower one first. Yeah. I can't afford anything, as usual. I mean, I can afford the automated reloader, which is nice, but not really all that great. But what I really need is fuel right now. Seriously, Zone, calm down. I have no idea how much you can hear him, but... Repair up to minus 10, and I have no money for anything else. Sure, I will try to capture the ship. I can do that. And let's exit the sector and go to the next sector. I believe this is the worst that I have ever entered into Sector 3. Abandoned Sector or Uncharted Nebula? I'm slug, so Uncharted Nebula is actually better for me. All the way up there. I have three fuel. 
Really hope I can find some place that, or some ship that will give me fuel. Anywhere at all would be nice. That's a lot of weaponry. I have made a horrible mistake, haven't I? I'm gonna die. smasher laser. Well, at least I have another laser. It's usually better than the heavy laser. I have one fuel left. So, no matter where I go, that's where I'm going to be stuck at for a bit. I'd rather be stuck down here. I think here would suffice, but let's finish repairing first. I am out of fuel. Oh, great. Ion Storm. That was luck. Pure luck. That's okay. Okay, and... It's much easier for me to handle one of them than it is two of them. Laser and my weapons aren't going to do me any good. So... Go like that. not going to go well, by the way. Basically what I need to do is take that med bay out of commission, otherwise I am screwed and I can't do a thing about it. Like that.
to original locations. trapped under a furry animal, and I need to use the bathroom. This is annoying. I was actually expecting me to lose this run by now. Eh, good enough. And bounce. A bouncy, bouncy, bouncy. Absolutely nothing. Disappointing. So I'm pretty sure they can't hurt us, so. Quest first. Alright, need to do this without destroying the ship. Easier said than done. Can they hurt me? Theoretically, yes. Actually, not just theoretically, they can definitely hurt me.
There we go. Heavy ion. Not bad. I will probably end up equipping that. Mostly because I'm out of missiles anyway, or nearly out. Heal up. Well, repair the med bay first and then heal up. Oh, right. Would help if I actually healed. Do -do 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 -do. run's still not going too bad, or too great, but it's passable-ish. Right, would help if I actually powered my engines. To start speaking, really hope they give me fuel, because I've got nothing otherwise. They did not give me fuel. Beacon on. Wait. Ten scrap per fuel. No. Just no. What the hell is wrong with you people? I'm not so sure they can actually hurt me. Especially when I can do that. Oh, right. They're immune to mind control. Forgot about that. There. That works better. Seriously? I got five fuel and gained scrap. Much better deal. Can always use more scrap. Although I'm really low on all the things right now. <sighs> Let's go ahead and start upgrading some things. First off, need more power. Everything else I will analyze. To the exit! Hmm, people will probably be arriving soon. Specialty, upgrading oxygen. However, they don't upgrade as soon. No, not this time. It's a really good deal, usually, and that was... Oh, crap, I should have. If I would have realized what I was jumping into, I totally would have. I'm probably not going to live through this. But oh well. I apologize for all the meows you likely hear of in the distance. I am basically just running through this at this point. Nice! I don't think I've ever had that event before. I mean, I'm going to die, but... Four slug crew members over there. I can't fight off four slugs. I can fight off two at best. I love the new battle music, by the way. I think this is my best bet. Well, I don't need that, so... There. I'll pump up... Or 
went down an engine, I think. Yeah, I would pretty much have to use a missile in order to get through, so... Four shots it is. Bye bye! That was a good run. I horribly died due to bad luck, but that's okay. Until next time, play more FTL? Wait, no. That, that, that's we'll wait and sign off. Oh, hey look! Kitty got off my lap. He must know that it's time for me to get up. Bye!